What's good, sneaker fan? Welcome back to our sneakers. Before I start, I do want to say that I am doing a Jordan raffle for this shoe right here. Every raffle ticket is a dollar, and if you want to go join that, you can go down in the description. There's a link that says Jordan 1 raffle. Click on that, and it'll take you to where you can purchase the ticket. There's a total of 300 entries. Right now, there's 30 in so far, so get them while they last. Anyways, let's get on to what you guys are here for, and that is on how to lace this shoe right here. Somebody did request this video a while ago, but I am going to do it now just because there is a Yeezy release this Saturday, and I'm pretty sure you guys that haven't got this Yeezy V2 yet are going to be wondering how to lace them, so I figured why not do it now. Alright, so to start off, you want to grab your laces and go ahead and put them through these first two holes. One on this side and one on this one. And once you got them through, you won't, it is going to be through the inside of the shoe. You do want to grab both of them and hold them so they are even and just... Pull. You want to make sure they are even all the way through, so if you drop the shoe, it should be even at the tips. And you want to make sure you don't have too much slack, but also don't make it too tight. Because these laces are long, but so if you want a long knot at the end, go ahead and tighten them all the way. But if you want them even like I laced my shoes, then leave some slack. Go ahead and get the shoelace and put it out through this hole for this side, and then this hole for this side. And once again, you do want to grab them evenly and pull all the way through. And this one could be tight because it's going to be the inside of the shoe and you really don't want to feel that lace on your foot. And now what you want to do, if you have the left shoe, you're going to get the left side of the shoelace and go across and put it to the inside of the hole. But if you have the right shoe, you're going to start with this one. You want to go from the outside to the inside, basically. You guys can see, just pull all the way through, leave some slack, and then we'll even that out after. So basically what this does is that it gets the outside of the shoelaces to go over the inside of the laces. That's just the way I like it personally, so that's why I'm doing it this way. Once again, grab both tips and then pull evenly. And leave like that amount of slack. And you wanna continue doing the same thing all the way throughout the shoe up to the top. So if you've done everything correctly, your shoe should look something like that. As you can see, everything looks even, nice. Not too loose, not too tight. And then at the end, your shoelaces should be even and your shoe should hang straight. So what you want to do to tie it at the top so you have a nice bow that ends up sideways and not vertical, you want to go ahead and grab the right lace, go behind and get the left lace and go in front, and then that right lace that you threw behind, you want to go around and go ahead and pull that. And then you want to go ahead and make a little loop with what's on the left side. And then with the laces on the right side, you want to come forward so you see that the right lace is going naturally it's on the front side well you want to go around and then through the little hole there and then just pull so then as you can see the lace does end up nice and even sideways but i'm going to redo it so you guys can see how it looks better so now as you guys can see it is 100 percent even the laces don't go all too far here they are perfectly even the end of this the plastic does go match up with the loop and it looks, looks nice and even. If you don't have that much lace to hang out, you can also just throw it to the side and let it hang because it looks nice as well, but since mine are a little long, I decided to tie it up. And that's your final product. Also, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you have any more suggestions on what I should do in this channel, make sure you leave them down in the comments below as well. Don't forget to subscribe. We are trying to get to 2,000 by the end of this year. I do have a special video for you guys, so make sure you guys keep subscribing if you want to see that. Make sure you stay woke. It's your boy, Sticker Sign out. Peace.